The pregnancy category of a medication is an assessment of the risk of fetal injury due to the pharmaceutical, if it is used as directed by the mother during pregnancy. It does not include any risks conferred by pharmaceutical agents or their metabolites in breast milk. Every drug has specific information listed in its product literature. The British national formulary used to provide a table of drugs to be avoided or used with caution in pregnancy, and did so using a limited number of key phrases, but now Appendix 4, which was the pregnancy table, has been removed. Appendix 4 is now titled, Intravenous Additives. However, information that was previously available in the former Appendix 4, Pregnancy, and Appendix 5, Breastfeeding, is now available in the individual drug monographs. United States American law requires that certain drugs and biological products must be labeled very specifically. Title 21, Part 201.57 I of the Code of Federal Regulations lists specific requirements regarding the labeling of drugs with respect to their effects on pregnant populations, including a definition of a pregnancy category. These rules are enforced by the Food and Drug Administration. To supplement this information, FDA publishes additional rules regarding pregnancy and lactation labeling. The FDA does not regulate labeling for all hazardous and non hazardous substances. Many substances, including alcohol, are widely known to cause serious hazards to pregnant women and their fetus, including fetal alcohol syndrome. Many other pollutants and hazardous materials are similarly known to cause reproductive harm. However, some of these substances are not subject to drug labeling laws, and are therefore not assigned a pregnancy category for 21 CFR 201.57. One characteristic of the FDA definitions of the pregnancy categories is that the FDA requires a relatively large amount of high quality data on a pharmaceutical for it to be defined as pregnancy category A. As a result of this, many drugs that would be considered pregnancy category A in other countries are allocated to category C by the FDA. Pregnancy and Lactation Labeling Rule of December 2014 on December 13, 2014, the FDA published the Pregnancy and Lactation Labeling Final Rule PLLR, which changed the labeling requirements for the pregnancy and lactation sections for prescription drugs and biological agents. The final rule removed the pregnancy letter categories, and created descriptive subsections for pregnancy exposure and risk, lactation, and effects to reproductive potential for females and males. Labeling changes from this rule began on June 30, 2015, with all submissions for prescription drugs and biological agents using the labeling changes immediately. Previously approved drugs from June 30, 2001 will switch to the new labeling gradually. The rule does not affect the labeling of over-the-counter drugs. Australia Australia has a slightly different pregnancy category system from the United States, notably the subdivision of category B for drugs in B1, B2 and B3 categories, human data are lacking or inadequate. Subcategorization is based on animal data, and allocation of AB category does not imply greater safety than C category. The system, as outlined below, was developed by medical and scientific experts based on available evidence of risks associated with taking particular medicines while pregnant. Being general in nature it is not presented as medical advice to health professionals or the public. Some prescribing guides, such as the Australian Medicines Handbook, are shifting away from using pregnancy categories since, inherent in these categories, there is an implied assumption that the alphabetical code is one of safety when this is not always the case. Categorization does not indicate which stages of fetal development might be affected and does not convey information about the balance between risks and benefits in a particular situation. Additionally, maintenance of categories is not necessarily maintained or updated with availability of new data. Germany Categorization of selected agents The data presented is for comparative and illustrative purposes only, and may have been superseded by updated data. Notes
References Why Poison Your Baby? PRN2.USM.MY. Archived from the original on 17 May 2003. Medicines in Pregnancy Working Party, 14 February 2007. Prescribing Medicines in Pregnancy. Australian Drug Evaluation Committee. Archived from the original on 5 June 2007. Retrieved 21 May 2008, links provided for 1999 fourth edition and subsequent updates Sanderstedt, R. Lundborg, P. Daniel Sun, B. R. et al., February 1996. Drugs during pregnancy, an issue of risk classification and information to prescribers. Drug SAF, 14 69–77. Doi 10.2165.0000020018.199614020-0000001. PMID 8852521. Food and Drug Administration. Federal Register 1980, 44-37434-67. Specific requirements on content and format of labeling for human prescription drugs. Labeling requirements for prescription drugs and or insulin. Food and Drug Administration. April 1, 1997. Archived from the original on 26 March 2008. Retrieved 21 May 2008.